Hey guys, hope this finds you very well. I have run out of all my hair products and I know that my running out is not quite the same as somebody else's running out, but I do like to try a bunch of different things so that I can feed back to you guys. What's cool about everything featured in this video is it is all black owned and from black owned emporiums or e-retailers. So if you're watching this and you are not black or a person of colour, do not at all be put off. In fact, I encourage you to come in because a lot of the people that have created these products have themselves got curly to kinky hair. So you might just be looking for the perfect leave-in or deep conditioner or something and they have got it for you. My first few things are from antidotestreet.com and I have to say the shipping on this was superb. I ordered a bunch, pretty much a lot of this stuff on Friday afternoon and this came first thing Monday morning, like seven o'clock in the morning. Also, antidotestreet.com is the suppliers of Freddie Harrell's Big Hair No Care. So if you're looking for clip-in hair extensions or just hair extensions that blend with kinky to coily hair, then this is where to go, definitely. My first item is the Bouclemé Curls Defined Stronghold Gel. This is by Michelle Scott Lynch. She is a woman of colour. So this curl defining gel has zero silicone, sulfates or parabens. And of course she does have a curly co-wash and a curl defining cream as well. So Antidote Street were really, really kind to send me a sample of Anita Grant's Curl Cleansing Co-wash Conditioner. So that was really kind of them. And I also picked up a sample of the Anita Grant Creamy Cafe Latte Vanilla daily leave-in butter. So this is, I can just see that it's like runny because my room is boiling hot right now. Yeah. This smells like tiramisu. This smells like tiramisu. Delicious. So I can't wait to try that. I did actually end up going on the Anita Grant website and I will say that shipping was amazing as well because I ordered that Saturday night and that came first thing Tuesday morning. So really, really great shipping. And I just got the full size of the Curl Cleansing Curl Wash Conditioner, but this time it's rosemary and mint. And the particular reason I wanted to go for this is rosemary is a hair stimulant, as is mint. It's a bit more, mint is just that gives you that refreshing, tingling feeling, so that's gonna help that blood rush to the scalp and really encourage hair growth. Yeah, it smells like, it smells like peppermint candies. Those really nice, soft peppermint candies. So <laughs> I'm quite, I've never tried anything that like makes my scalp tingle before. So <laughs> I'm quite apprehensive, but excited to see how this one goes. I then went on britishcurlies.co.uk, I think it is. I think it's the only place that you can get curl formers from. So if you are looking for curl formers, check them out. And British Curlies is owned by Keisha Jo Lawler, who is also the creator of Trepidora products. And I've tried those before and I do get on with them quite well. So that's a little fact for you. But from there, I picked up Crown Pride Naturals little hair kit. They have a few little uh, trial size kits. And this one's particularly good for 3C to 4C hair. So in here, we have got a curl cream gel and I don't know if you can see but it's super duper watery. I wonder how that would fare on my hair and what kind of thing I should use this for. That's cool. Then I've also got the avocado detangling conditioner. Another thing inside is the Nalotica and Mango Buttercream. So it's an emollient moisturiser for thick curly hair types suitable for type 4 curls and kinks. This smell this smells really good. This smells kind of like, I don't even know, like white chocolatey vanilla cake. Oh, I just love it because do you know what? Nowadays I'm like, do I even really need to wear perfume when my hair smells so good? It just, you know, evokes it into the air. So who needs it? And the last little thing in my kit is the Curl Control Styling Puree. Yeah, really, really, really jelly-like. Quite like a puree. Oh my god, this smells like a like a jelly sweet. It's it's not jelly babies, I can't quite put my fingers on it, but something kind of gooey, gelatin-like, it smells like that. And it's delicious. Yes. So I'll try that all out together, see how I get on, and then see if there's anything else from Crown Pride Naturals that I want to try. Then I got a few things from Shea Butter Cottage, which is owned by Akua Wood. I hope I'm pronouncing her name correctly. I got Rasool Clay, so she's got a bunch of different 
clays and she's got henna as well. And I'll definitely be doing a video on this and why I prefer Rasool clay to bentonite. I then picked up the avocado and coconut leave-in conditioner. Really quite lotion-like, like a runny lotion. So it'll be exciting to see how this works on my hair. It is very citrusy, refreshing. It smells, it must have lavender because it smells quite relaxing as well. Lastly, I picked up the deep conditioning bar. So it's just got like an embossment on there and it had paper inside, so let's see. Okay, so I break off, I break off pieces of this, mix it with freshly boiled water and blend into a paste. Cool, and it also says I can substitute part of or all of the water with coconut milk or rubibos tea. I can never say that type of tea, rubibos tea. Well, I thought that I was just gonna be like, you know, kind of like how I did with the shampoo bar. I thought I was just gonna be smoothing onto my hair, but you break pieces off. So that's great, because that means this will last me quite some time. This is the Coco and Marula deep conditioning bar with agave as well, so. Mm. Something really cute in my Shea Butter Cottage uh, package was this little note. It just says, thank you, Zara, which is really cute. And then it says, thank you so much for your purchase and support. It does help build a better future. We will be donating a percentage of your purchase towards our Helping Hand program. Please visit our social responsibility page on our website to learn more. I didn't know at all that Shea Butter Cottage had a little Helping Hand program. So that's made me even happier that I've made a purchase there. I guess it's giving back to the community. So that's really, really great. I open this, but I haven't opened the products yet, just so I can put it in its little kit. This is by Shade Decadence, and it is the Kinky Girls Twist Kit. The Hair Latte Conditioning Hair Milk. Looks like this. And I, I'm in love with these little um, spray bottle things. It's just, just makes everything so much easier. It makes me feel like I'm in a salon as well. It says a drizzling of glycerin and a sprinkling of silk make for a moisturizing hair milk. <laughs> that is cute. Use as often as required to revive dry kinks, curls and waves. Okay, so I suppose it's, yeah, daily. So I can just spritz that in to moisturize, I think. Okay, this is a, a quite sweet. Ah, now that I've churned it a bit, it almost smells like shredded coconut, but like really sweet shredded coconut. The next thing I've got in there is the Coco Frappuccino Curl Defining Leave-In Conditioner, moisturizing, defining and nourishing, intensely moisturizing, rich and creamy concentrated leave-in conditioner that will define your natural kinks and curls. That's what I was really interested in when I was having a scour through. It said that this will just instantly define your kinks, so, Ooh, I'm gonna put it to the test, definitely, but it just looks like this. Really cute, handy pump as well. So Coco Frappuccino, so it should smell chocolatey, I hope, anyway. Really nice, thick and creamy. Yeah, it smells, it kind of smells like a chocolate cookie. So yeah, I think I've got a bit on my nose. The Caramel Curls Shine and Define Styling Balm. Decadent balm crammed full of Jamaican black castor oil and premium organic shea butter. Excellent use on damp hair to provide hold for twists and braid outs. I'm down. I'm definitely gonna try that for a braid out. These last two products I did not get in this haul, but I thought I would mention them because they are by black owned businesses. So the first is Big Hair Beauty. They have an entire range, but I picked up the deep conditioning hair treatment with banana, honey, and rasool clay. And it smells like real bananas, like that proper, you know, about to put banana bread in the oven, smells like real bananas. And then also, ages ago, I did do a review on this, Modi Hair Cream. I still have loads of, because a little bit goes a long way, and this is more of a sealant or finishing product. This is, I hope I'm not forgetting, but it's by Jeanette, and I really, really hope, I don't know what she's got in the pipelines, but I really hope that she expands her range and brings out a few other things, because this is fantastic packed full of amazing ingredients and works really, really well to give hold, mild hold and a nice shine, as well as locking that moisture in. So 
love this and you can order this on Modi's website or on antidotestreet.com. But those are all of my hair products, you know, I think it's really quite important to support small and independent local businesses, female businesses and black owned businesses. So I will leave down below shopblack.com and some other websites that will give you an idea of places to shop to support. And shopblack.com isn't just about hair care, it offers loads of different things and um, it's not just exclusive to like the UK. I did see articles for France and Brooklyn on there, but you'll be pleased to know pretty much all I think of the emporiums and places that I've ordered from do ship worldwide. I certainly know that Shea Butter Cottage ships worldwide, so that's really great. Do follow me on all my social media, please do all of that YouTube stuff like sharing this video, liking, subscribing if you're new. I hope you enjoyed this video, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!